Isn't it nice of Mrs. Van Snob to invite us kids to a garden party, Lulu? Sure was, Annie. But it'd be even nicer if Wilbur wasn't going to be there. Yeah, Wilbur can be such a drip. <laughs> drip, eh? <laughs> They're the ones who are going to be dripping. Sir, sir, is your truck blue? Blue? No, my truck is red. Then that's the one Officer McNabb's giving a ticket to. Is he nuts? I work for the city. <laughs> Gee, what's the matter, Wilbur? Everyone's invited to my mother's party except me. Gosh, Wilbur, that's terrible. Why? Sit down and I'll tell you. You sat in wet paint. What? <laughs> Let's get him. <laughs> I don't think you want to do that, Wilbur. Sure I do. Because <laughs> you'll never catch me. <laughs> Guess it's eating time at the zoo. Gosh, Wilbur, what happened to your clothes? Bear, clothes gone. Well, we've got to go home and change for a party. Have a nice day, Wilbur. Wait, you can't leave me here naked. Please get me something to wear. I'll do whatever you want. I guess we could help, but only because we're extra nice people, Wilbur. Don't go anywhere. <laughs> ah! No way I'm going to wear this. What if I run into the fellers? Hey, Lulu. Who's your new friend? Hi, boys. This is Mimi. She just arrived in town. Hi, Mimi. I'm Tubby. I sure hope you're going to Wilbur's boring party. What do you mean, boring? I... I mean, yes, I am. Well, you can go with me. No, me. I saw Mimi first. Yeah, no, but I was me. Me quite safe. Do try a fish and truffle, dear. Ah, look, Wilbur's friends are arriving. But where's Wilbur? Hello, girls. How nice to see you. And who's this pretty little girl? This is Mimi. I hope it was okay for her to come. I thought Wilbur might like to meet her. How do Hello. You do? I'm sure you're right, Lulu. Cranberry, please find Wilbur. I bet he's still getting all dressed up for the party. Hey, hey Mimi. Mimi, can I get you something? Can Mimi? I get you some juice, Mimi? Some fish head truffle? How about a kiss? Hold your horses, fellers. Mimi has to freshen up now. <laughs> your mother's party sure is fun so far, Wilbur. Yeah, make us sit in wet paint for the next one, too, okay? I swear I'm never going to play a trick again. Master Wilbur? Yeah, yeah, I'm coming. Oh, Wilbur, there you are. Son, I want you to meet Mimi. Now, where did that young lady go? Uh, maybe Mimi had to go. Maybe she's never coming back. Oh. Well, if she did, we'd just tell everyone where she lives and who she is. If you get my drift. Cranberry, find Mimi right this minute. Yes, sir. Hurry, hurry. Oh, lovely. <laughs> now, Mimi, you were supposed to freshen up, yeah. not mess yourself up. This is for you, my princess. Thanks. I sure could use that. Wow! I think I'm in love. Oh, Mimi, there you are, dear. Now, if only Wilbur were here. Cranberry, find Wilbur for me at once. Yes, madame. Ah, oh, there you are, Mimi, my rosebud. You must be hungry. Tubby, how about offering the most beautiful girl you know a tidbit? That's just what I'm doing, Gloria. These bits are for Mimi. Whoa! <gasps> if Wilbur were here, he'd show you, Tubby Tompkins. Gloria, my angel. I mean, how about some angel cake there, fellers? Let me... I'll get it. No, you won't. Out of my way! Oh, where is Wilbur when I need him? Oh. <laughs> up, up. Master Wilbur, your mother is looking for you. Are you doing something different with your hair? Yikes! Oh, Mimi, where are you? Oh, Master Wilbur. Oh, 
Mimi. We want Mimi. We want Mimi. Ah! I thought I was the prettiest girl in the neighborhood. Where's Wilbur? Here I am, Gloria. Who are you? What are you? At least I'm prettier than you. Ah, there you are, Wilbur. My son. I fell for Wilbur. Looks like everyone fell for him. Or is it her? 